Thank you. And thank you very much, but I've got to be timid because I've got drinks. I've got drinks. I need a sign on the back of my car that says I've got hot drinks in this car and no cup holders. What's up guys? Welcome to Supercars of London. How are you doing? And welcome to a beautiful day here in the UK. In today's video, I'm gonna be replicating one of the first videos I did with the Audi R8. When I bought that car, I wanted to try and do everyday things but in the R8, which at the time I classed as a supercar, but it was more of a super sports car. Today, what I wanna do is put the Lamborghini to the test and see whether this can handle a McDonald's drive-through. But we're not gonna be doing just any McDonald's drive-through. Like last time, we're gonna be doing a McDonald's roulette. Now, if you don't know what that is, basically, I'll drive up, I will wait until someone puts an order in before me in the car in front, and then I will go up to the speaker thing where you put your order in and ask for exactly the same as the car in front. Hello, Hi, uh, could I order what the car in front has ordered, please? Oh, what, sorry? Can I order what the car in front has ordered? Everything the same? Oh, that was, uh... So it's a roulette. It could literally be anything. You could pick anything and then you have to buy it regardless of what it is you have to buy it you can see one veggie wrap one medium diet coke two of my least favorite things from mcdonald's that is absolutely horrible uh, oh my god now there are a few things that need to be considered in this particular car as opposed to the audi r8 Firstly, this has zero cup holders. Most meals at McDonald's come up with a drink included, and there's no space for that. Absolutely no space for that. Not only that, the interior of this car is a lot newer than the R8, so I would feel even worse if I muck the interior up. Fingers crossed and touch wood, I don't, but there's always an option when you're doing something like a McDonald's drive through in any car, that you could spill a chip, you could spill salt, you could spill ketchup, or you could even spill a drink, which is highly likely with the fact that this doesn't have any cup holders. So it's safe to say this video has been in my diary for the last two to three weeks. I've always wanted to do a McDonald's roulette in the Lamborghini, see how it copes with an everyday chore, such as doing a McDonald's drive through I haven't eaten breakfast, I'm absolutely starving, so I kind of hope that there is a big work van in front that is ordering about four or five different meals. Not that I could finish four or five meals, but I'd feel that is a sufficient amount of food for me to fill my belly. So let's head to McDonald's right now and see what we get. I'm so hungry, I don't know which camera to look at. We're coming in to McDonald's right now, and the time is 10 past 12. How likely is it that we're gonna have someone come in, someone has, oh, there's a queue. We have got a queue of one, two, three cars. We've got, well, four cars. And one, Luckily, it's a small city car that is in front. It's actually a Fiat 500. But then in front of that, it's a four x four. So, looking at both cameras, if the, if the four x four orders, and then for some reason, and the, oh, someone's reversing. Can they not get around the corner? Let's try and squeeze, squeeze. Don't curve a wheel. <laughs> Is it always gets nerve wracking? This is a long order. This is a long order and there's only one person in the car in front. Here we go, here we go. Hello, can I possibly, can I order exactly what the car in front has ordered? Yep. Exactly the same? Okay. Can I have a look at what it is? Yeah, no problem. 
Okay. There's more, there's more. Is it eight quid already? Is there a receipt? Or is it in the next window? The receipt? The next, next window. window. Okay, thank you. <laughs> right, okay. What I saw was a blueberry muffin, a tea, which is a hot drink with no cup holders. And I've just seen some plastic knives and forks get given to the car in front. What does that even mean? I'm really nervous. 10 quid. And there's only one person in the car in front. There's a massive brown bag. <laughs> oh. okay, they've finished their order. Oh, that was close. You see that pillar? Hello. Hiya. Can I take your order? Um, it was, there was a blueberry muffin in it. <laughs> They're getting confused because it's the same order. They didn't know whether there was a duplicate order or whether they ordered it wrong at the last window. Sorry about that. You, got, you did the same order. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, yes. How many sugars and how many milk shall I get here? Pardon? How many sugars and milk? For your tea? No, uh, none, please. Nothing. Nothing. Thank you. Thank you. Shall I give you the cup holder? Yes, please, yeah. It hasn't got cup holders, this car. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. Is that it? I want you to pop your car, actually. Oh, I need to pop my car? Yeah. One second. Yes. And that should be your GVC? Okay. And I want you to park your big car and then I'll take it to you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Squeeze. Whilst I'm waiting for the food that's supposed to come or the £10 worth of food that I'm supposed to come, this is what I'm having to deal with at the moment. I've got a hot drink and a Coke that's actually quite filled up. Normally, you don't get it that filled up. So I don't know whether they're, 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 they're trolling me or not, that's hot. And now I'm waiting for um, the rest of my food. Hey, look at that, whoa. Here we go, here we go. Here comes my meal. Oh yeah. There you go, sorry about the wait. Thank you, no worries. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's like I'm delivering the post. But, here we go, this is like an unboxing video now. Oh my god, there's a salad. <laughs> Look. Who orders a salad from McDonald's? One deli that looks like sweet chili chicken. Love them. Crispy chicken salad. Fingers down, thumb down. A blueberry muffin, a tea, a Coke, fries, and balsamic dressing. This is having to be timid driving because of the drinks that I have. I've got a hot tea and a Coke. That is the queue for the drive through and there's no car parking spaces, which means <laughs> I've got drinks that are falling over. They're actually falling over. Oh my God. Thank you. And thank you very much, but I've got to be timid because I've got drinks. I've got drinks. I need a sign on the back of my car that says I've got hot drinks in this car and no cup holders. Um, I'm gonna pull in here. I'm gonna pull in the petrol station. Is this a good idea? I don't even drink tea. Ah, it's bumpy. 
Uh oh. Oh! This is the disaster. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna eat the deli. I'm so hungry, I'm just gonna eat the deli. Looks horrendous. At, oh! This is dodgy. This is dangerous. So, I mean, I think that was a success. Let me know in the comment box below what you order from McDonald's or what you would order from McDonald's. And then, if you knew that the car behind was doing a McDonald's roulette, what would you order to stitch them up? Have you ever done a McDonald's roulette as well? Let me know in the comment box below. I have, oh, please. I have finished um, and I'm just gonna try and nail these chips, Coke and sandwich. Not sure what to do with the salad. I'll probably offer it to someone at SB Race Engineering. But thank you for watching, as always, and supporting the Supercars London channel. I hope you've enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe if you're new and give it a thumbs up as well for this. I've just got McDonald's bag everywhere. <laughs> We've got a wayward rubbish truck thing. It is literally all over the road in the middle.